Hello everyone and welcome back to Echoes of the Plum Grove. My name is Melanie V. It is now Wednesday the 10th day of fall and we have our flower ready here. Uh, I don't know, what can we make with flour exactly? Um, we can make pancakes if we have maple syrup. We can make basic breakfast? No. Um, how do we make bread? Bread requires flour and an egg. Well, I don't have eggs right now. But maybe we'll put some stuff away before we head out. Um, what do we not want to take with us? We can put that away. This can go. The rot can go away too. Um, the worm scan as well. I don't need to carry around fertilizer. And the leaves can hang out back here. Let's get these seeds. Now, these seeds are fall seeds, so we can plant them. And they're three days. Yeah, let's plant these today. Is there anything else we want? We have so many acorns. Look at all this. Um, these are gonna rot. <laughs> I'm gonna have to sell those to someone. Let's just grab them out of the pocket right now. And we'll trade it to someone. Hopefully somebody buys it. Okay, it's a rainy day, right? So we don't have to do any watering today. Get to see our trees aren't grown as yet. Um, hopefully within the next couple of days though. Let's check the mail. And we got a letter for a skilled crafter from Molly Chesney. She would like a candy maker. Um, do we even know how to make a candy maker? Let's have a look. Back to the crafting table. Candy maker. So we need pine sap. Oh. We collect this from a pine tree. So we must be able to make a tapra. How do we make a tapra though? Could be one of these items down here. But we don't have the recipe for it. Okay, well, in that case, Molly, um, we're gonna have to reject your request. Okay, I think we shall head into town. Uh, maybe we should see what kind of quest we have available. Right, we have one that needs nails. We might have some nails. Let's double check here. Oh, look, we got exactly 12. How fortuitous. So, should we go straight down to Limbo? Or maybe we should go into town first. Actually, I want to go into the forest. We got some forging to do. We do have one more item that we're still missing. I'm kind of wondering, maybe I'm supposed to go at a certain time of day to find different forgeables. Not really sure. Or maybe it's something that appears on rainy days only. Who knows? But we will definitely take some blackberries. And we'll take this acorn too. Hmm, nothing new around here. And what about around here? I can't see anything new. behind a tree and we got this one already <gasps> oh look this one is definitely new that's gotta be it so we'll look under forgeables and fall we've got all eight fantastic so I'm not sure now if it just happens to be coincidentally here 
or if it requires a rainy day for it to appear. Uh, let's say hello to Root. How's it going, Root? That's nice. Do you have anything to trade? I don't need any of this stuff, but thanks. See you around. So what is that even called? Let's have a look again. It's called a Devil's Tooth. A mushroom that looks like it's bleeding. Ew. Okay, uh, should we go into the mines today? Do I have my lantern? Yeah, we can go into the mines for a bit. I definitely can always use more uh, iron and gold too, if we can find it. Okay, lantern on. And down we go. Around the bend. And into the first cavern. Now I think I was gonna try fishing here at one point. Let's go ahead and see what we can find here. Just a bunch of rocks. Okay, let's get out our fishing rod. Oh yeah, it looks like we can fish here. You know what? We're really hungry. We should eat something. one was kind of tricky, but we got a cave fish. That makes sense. Is there anything other than cave fish in here? Okay, for some reason there is that big block that appears on the game. I don't know if it's because we're in a cave. Might be. Okay, got another cave fish. Let's go one more time. Let's see if we can get a gold quality one. Gold quality, please. And after then we'll have something to eat. Oh my goodness, this guy is tricky. <laughs> Oh, we finally got him. Ah, uh, he's just a bronze quality too. Okay, let's have some blackberries. Let's eat the lowest quality first. We might have to eat all of this. In order to get our hunger bar filled up. On to the next one. And there we go. That should be good enough. Okay, let's go deeper into the caves. And there's a little bit of water here. I don't think we can fish in it though. <laughs> No, we definitely cannot. Okay, let's see what we get from here. Some iron and some clay and copper. And on to the next cave we go. Oops. This time I'm hoping we can find some gold.
Mm, no gold. We found copper and iron. Okay. Well, we are heading out of here. And... I think we'll head down to Limbo. But I kind of want to forge some more. Now, I wonder if that Devil's Tooth can be found anywhere else. Or if it's just like pretty much like all the other mushrooms. You can only find it in the forest. I'm inclined to think it's just for the forest only. Down the spirals we go. And we have arrived at the bottom. And of course, there are some quests for us to complete. Okay, let's see whose quest we completed. So it'd be this person right here. Uh, Deanne Hudson. There you go. So we got 180 mana. And let's see what Clementine Hull wants. Oh my goodness, Clementine, I don't have any yarn. Stop asking for yarn, please. Hey, Nathan. You would like some meat. Uh, six pieces of pork. That's a no. That would be a very hard no, in fact. Okay, let's see if there's anything we can turn in. No, we don't have any gold star fish. I thought I had a gold star fish. What happened to it? Nothing to donate here. No animal produce. Do you have some forgeables? Okay, so we've donated the 30 gold star portables now, but now we just need ores. What about over here? Gold star meals. We've got zero. And how's our friendship looking? Not so great. Okay, let's head back into town. I want to check out the quest board and I want to go see Kat. And see if she has any good meals for us to purchase. It's so late already. How did it get so late? Okay, someone is looking for some fish. Edward Bailey. Uh, some perch. Yeah, we should take that one. And some squash for Alice O'Dell. Oh, she'll give us a nice little dress. I will take that. If we can get those squash to her, we might have to purchase it. Let's grab that. Oops. And we'll grab this as well. And into the tavern we go. Oh, it's closed. It is pretty late after all. Okay, it's after 9 p.m. So it is time for us to head home. Maybe we'll actually get to bed at a decent time today. We'll take some blackberries, of course. And some wood, too. Okay, is our furnace finished as yet? Not quite. I'm gonna check in on my little coop animals. Oh, look how cute they are. Now we got lots of straw in there still. Yeah, they're all happy. Okay, I think let's actually go and get our watering can refilled.
And that will be ready for tomorrow. Oh no, I forgot to sell any acorn. Um, we didn't really come across anyone to sell it to, I guess. Well, it's probably gonna go bad, but what can we do about it now? Let's get to bed. And I think that's gonna be it for today's episode. Thank you very much for watching.